Yes, back at it again. Yeah, part three. All right. Time to wrap the coil. Time to make so take some measurement to wrap the coil. Yeah. I find the size wire on a TV yoke. Yeah, the TV yoke. Yeah, pull off the outside of the coil. This is it. So yeah. Time to mark the metal, the tinning. To, to, to make the coil. This is what's going, going to make the coil. Alright, so I'm going to cut the amount that I want to make the coil for the speaker. Alright. Okay, my viewers. This is the coil. This is what's going to make the coil. Alright. Yeah, so I'm going to put it inside here. Fold it around to get it round up and tape it. Set it for the Kyle. Alright, so look forward towards the Kyle wrapping. Alright. Alright, as you can see, a broomstick. Alright. So you put the tin in around the broomstick like this. Because you want to get it round. Where there is no problem wrapping the Kyle. So after the Kyle is wrapped on it. And the epoxy, the epoxy get tough. Yeah, they will continue to be round. But before I do so, I put a little roundness into it. All right. Yeah. Yeah, man. Started to wrap in the coil. Just in my hand, you know what I mean? Wrap in the coil for the speaker. Yeah? Take a little more time, but you know? Taking my time to do it. Yeah? So you know, rub on a little epoxy first. Don't put too much hardener inside of it. You don't want it to dry too quick. You want it to keep on stick. That's the wire stick onto it. Alright? Take time and wrap it on. Trying to wrap a eight worm sky layer. Yeah. Trying to wrap a eight worm sky layer. The big bad speaker, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Drying time for the coil. Yeah. The whole length of the coil is four inch, and the coil wire is two inch high. All right. So yeah, man. Give it some time to dry, then pull it off. Try it inside here. Make sure it fit. All right. So yes my viewers, stick around to see what's coming next. Time to check the coil, make sure it fits. Right here. Yeah man, coil fit ready to go. Right. Yep. Yeah man, the big bad speaker. Just a preview, you know. Just catch on the cone, show you how it look with the cone on. Yeah. Yes, I look nice, don't it? All right. See. Big bad speaker soon already. Glue in the cone right now. Yeah. Time to put on the lead wire. All right. And a cup and thing, lead wire in. It not epoxy up yet still, but I'm gonna run a test and now see the worms, how much it I read. Yeah. Don't you know what's the name of the sound laying in the Alright. Six pint eight worms not too bad. Yeah man, write this up. Mmm, I'm going to play it 
2000 watt QSC, you know. So 6.8 ohms not too bad. Yeah, lead wires on. Inside the epoxy up, yeah. So I'm gonna cut the car a little shorter, you know what I mean? And then I can run some tests on it, you know. Put some signal to it so it sound. Without out the box. Alright, stay tuned. Yes, my viewers. Yeah, man. Right now we're we are in part three right now with the big bad speaker. See? Yeah. So part four, that is where you're gonna hear it play. Alright? So right now it is drying time for it. It is drying right now. So this is part three. So look out for part four. Part four is gonna be playing, man. It's gonna jerk down the whole place. Alright? So yeah man. You can check in the description for part one, two. You can watch part one and two. There, from there. Alright? If you never watched it before. Alright? So yes, my viewers, ever slick media. Don't forget to like, subscribe, to hit the notification bell to see the next video coming out. Alright? So peace. Blessings to everyone. Thanks for watching. All right. See you.